But you lost to Arsenal. Clearly. No debating. <laughs> In Ash, that's Nash. It's 30 pages of rhymes in this motherfucker. Yeah. All right. How y'all doing, man? This is uh, ROC, Rock Raw. How you doing? 30 pages of rhymes, OEP Media, all that fly shit. What I'm going to do right now on this installment of the great and illustrious show that has become um, 30 pages of rhymes. Um, we're going to recap the LOC League of Champions weekend. They had Air to the Crowns on Saturday. They had Blood on the Crowns on Sunday. So Air of the Crowns. Um, I made no predictions on, to Air of the Crowns, so my win-loss record is at 0-0. Zero, zero. I'm going to keep track of all my predictions. I'm going to try to. Uh, Y'all hold me to it. Y'all disagree with anything. Guess what? I don't give a fuck. I don't know what order the battle started off on Air of the Crowns, so I'm just going to go through the ones I remember. Uh, Fabio versus Crisis. It was a real good battle, real good back and forth. Uh, Crisis. Here's a high point for the battle. Fabio started off freestyling. Niggas ain't like it. Those technical difficulties. They came back. He went in his bag. He was cooking from then on out. Punched a nigga head off. Crisis was bar. Was, was spit that shit. I fuck with the shit he was spitting. And uh, he threw a hundred dollars in the sky. Uh, he made it rain on Fabio. Um, I don't remember the context of the bars. I remember he said something about 100 ones in the bars, I recall. But, uh, yeah, he, he was living his lyrics. And I fuck with a nigga that lived his lyrics. I really do. Um, so, yeah, I gave that one to Fabio, though. Because Fabio was really cooking. Crisis is nice, though. Be on the lookout for the nigga Crisis. He's good, he's good money. But Fabio was cooking. Um, let's see. Trill Dick versus Sonny. I gave that one 2-1 to Sonny, I believe. Um, it was real good, though. It was real good. It was a real good battle. Um... Once the footage comes out, I might change my perspective on it. But right now, the build that I gave it to one Sunday. Uh, my first time seeing either one of these niggas perform uh, live. They're both pretty fucking good. I will put both of them in a box. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's, it's jokes. It's jokes. It's clearly a joke. Clearly a joke. Ace Gully and Taliban. I gave that one to Taliban. It was a fucking great battle, though. It was great. Um... But yeah, uh, that's in the building once again. When the footage comes out, we'll see. Maybe I change my mind. But right now, I gave it to Taliban. Uh, Ciroc and Face. <sighs> I don't know. I really don't know who will won that be. I think I told him that at the venue. I think I told him I don't know who won. And I'm dead serious. I still don't know who won. When that footage comes out, that's going to tell that story. So um, hopefully that footage comes out pretty soon so I can watch it again and again and again and again. Let, don't let me forget uh, the ladies. The ladies had a battle. It was uh, El Renee, I think is her name, against Laura Key from Baltimore, I think is how you pronounce her name. I'm not sure if I'm mispronouncing your name. Um, um, lady, I apologize. Pardon me. Um, but I gave this battle to Laura Key. Uh, El Renee had a, a nasty choke, and I do not hold her accountable for that choke. That was not her fault. That was my man's fault. Rod, my nigga Rod was with me. You know what I'm saying? Nigga with dreads with the fucking sunglasses on inside. Ridiculous. He's a ridiculous nigga. He is the reason she choked. And she knows why. She knows what I'm talking about. El Renee knows what I'm talking about. And Rod knows what I'm talking about. If Rod, you watching this shit? Yo, you a mean nigga, my nigga. That shit was fucked up. And I told him that. I told him that at the video. I'm like, come on, man. My nigga. He was in her ear the whole night. Like, you gonna get body. You gonna get body. You gonna get zipped up. You probably gonna go up there and choke. He was saying all types of mean shit like that. And then he was like, yo. Why she choke? The fuck you mean why she choking? They're like, yo, I was trying to do the custom model thing. Like, you know what I mean? Uh, come on, my nigga. Can't everybody, ain't everybody Mike Tyson. Can't everybody take that custom model training? You know what I'm saying? If it cut the bottle, dude, he couldn't trade everybody the same fucking way. You gotta chill out with that shit, man. But he was, he was, he was cool. He had a good time. I had a good time. It was a great event. Shout out to everybody involved in that event. Blood of the Crabs. Um, I made some predictions for Blood of the Crabs. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, run through them. And um, see how good I was and what my win loss record was for the night. Um, I can almost guarantee you I was over 500. I'm, I'm the best at this shit. Can't nobody predict a battle like me because I'm the best. Um, A Train versus Vito Cognac. I think I had Vito winning this, but if you check the file, I think I said it could go either way. Uh, I was wrong on both counts because from all, I, I missed the battle. I only caught the end of it, but from what I'm hearing, uh, A Train put him in a box. So, I was wrong on both counts. So, I'm 0-1 now. A-Train won that, uh, from what I'm hearing. But, uh, 
We'll see when the footage comes out, but everybody's agreed that A-Trade, if he didn't put him in the box, he at least won. So, I'm on one. Uh, Pop Leash and Reby Tail. I gave it 2-1 Pop Leash, and um, there was some extenuating circumstances with this battle. The first round, I couldn't hear Reby Tail's first round. There was some chatter going on in the crowd. They got under control pretty quickly, and uh, niggas know what happened during that battle. Niggas who was there know what happened during the battle. What's, what's understood doesn't need to be said, basically. But um, I gave it 2-1 Pop Leash. That's who I, I believe I gave it 2-1 Pop Leash in the predictions. So I'm one and zero at this point. At this, I'm one and one at this juncture, right? Be he versus Sums was on the card. I didn't do a prediction for this, but it was a fucking classic. It was a one round battle. I wish it was three. They could cut this one round shit out. It was great. You know what I'm saying? I gave it to Be he in the venue. I can't wait for the footage to come out. Sums was cooking definitely. It, it was classic. It was one of the best battles of the night. Um, Bravo versus Omega, another one round battle. Cut this one round shit out. I want to see three rounds. That was a good battle. In the prediction blog, I said three zippy. Uh, uh, Omega's going to win three zip because you can't beat Jay-Z. And guess what? For the sake of my record, I'm going to say he didn't beat Jay-Z. So, you don't like it, nigga? Fuck. I don't care. Leave a comment. How about that? But it was a great battle, though. It was a great battle. Um, if a nigga said Bravo won, he probably did win. I don't know. I'm only saying Omega won because I want to keep my record. <laughs> it was a good battle, man. I got to see the footage to actually be sure who won. Because um, this is all tongue-in-cheek. My tongue is firmly in my cheek right now while I'm saying this, for doing these uh, recaps. But um, it was a great battle. I'm still going to give it to Omega. And y'all know why. I already told you. So I'm 2-1. and one. How about that? Jay Moore, very bad next. I think in my prediction, I gave that Jay 2-1 to Jay Moore. And that's how it ended up coming. That footage has actually come out, so I got to be able to review that. And, uh, yeah, that's how that battle went. It was 2-1 Jay Moore. Um, nigga, it was 3-0 in the building, clearly. Niggas was all saying that Barry got body, but when the footage came out, told a whole entirely different story. Um, I think it could have even went a different way if Barry wouldn't have, uh, you know what I mean, slipped up the couple of times he slipped up and, uh, let things get to him, uh, whatever the circumstances were, but he, he let things affect his, uh, his demeanor. And, um, you know what I mean? With that being said... Like I said, 2-1 Jay Moore. It was good, though. That nigga was cooking. That nigga was cooking unquestionably. But Barry Bad's second round was stupid. I fuck with that second round. Um, and niggas is funny on the internet with that shit, too. Jack Boy is hilarious. Jack Boy Man is hilarious. This nigga talking about there's no lights on the top of an ambulance. <laughs> nigga, there's lights all over the ambulance. Nigga said, I've been in the ambulance too many times. Like, how the fuck do you know where the lights are at on the outside of the ambulance from the inside, my nigga? He's the troll king. Him and Madface, they're the troll kings. So yeah, J Dash and Fastlane Fang didn't happen. Red Handed and Breeze didn't happen. And Jinya and Primo didn't happen. I'm mad at all y'all niggas. Except for Red Handed and Fastlane, because they were there actually there in the video in the venue. Red Handed, Fastlane were in the venue. Uh I think Big Jinya was there. I'm not sure. He might not have been there. He, I think he was at Air to the Crowns. And he already knew that his battle won't going down, I believe. Um, but all y'all other niggas, I'm mad at y'all. Word is biggity biggity bond. I'm mad at y'all niggas. Um, but, you know, I heard there's some circumstances to do with everybody. So, you know, be God bless you or whatever circumstances you have going on. But in the end, I don't give a fuck. Main event, Streets versus Moon. Um, and they're produced. So right now I'm three and one, right? I picked Jay Moore. So I'm three and one. So I picked Streets to win, I believe, on the blog. On the blog, whatever y'all niggas call it once again. Um... So I was wrong. In the venue, Moon won. In the venue, Moon won. We got to see that footage, though, because I might be right. I might be undefeated with this footage drop. I don't know, but right now I say I'm 3-2 because niggas are saying Moon won that. And it was a great battle. I think that was the battle of the night. I think that was the best all-around battle of the night. Um, it was very good. Moon was up there cooking. Streets was up there cooking. That shit was sweet. That shit was... That's battle rap right there, my nigga. That's some real shit. That's battle rap. Um, but, yeah, so at the end of the night, I'm 3-2. and two. Not bad. I'm over 500. Nigga, what are you? How about that? Bill Cosby face. Hey, shout out to LOC, man. Shout out to League of Champions. Shout out to uh, Bravo. Shout out to Fast Lane Fame. Shout out to BC. Everybody involved in the making and the, and the you know, production value of this event. It's a great weekend. You know what I'm saying? I can't wait for the next card. Um, and bad skills, I know you hear me, my nigga. Stop ducking me. 
We were supposed to battle. We were supposed to battle on Blood of the Crabs. That nigga did no show. You know what I'm saying? But I knew he wasn't show up. Nigga, who the fuck? Who would show up to battle me? You know what I mean? Like, nigga, I understand why you're ducking me. Because I'm the motherfucking Sun King. I am Confucius Cuffy. I am Superman for the Quest for Peace. I know why you don't want to battle me. But you signed the contract. I already got my deposit, my nigga. I already got my money, nigga. And I'm keeping it. Fast Lane ain't getting it back. How about that? He ain't getting his money back. Because, yo, know, they paid me and I showed up, nigga. You know what I mean? So next time I'm there, you know, be skills there, I'll come put blood in his mouth. I'm, you know what I mean? Niggas is a lot familiar killers. I'm a super friends killer. How about that, nigga? I ain't joking. Um, but, yeah, it was a great event. Shout out to everybody involved once again. Uh, this is Rock Raw, man. I'm signing out. 30 pages around, nigga. Peace. They hate us because they hate us. Could take everything we got and can't break us. I think they hate us because they ain't us. Y'all copy.